have a matter of fact update with the host of HGTV's Bargain Block, Keith Bynum and Evan Thomas. The couple is working in Detroit, Michigan to flip older homes and then sell them at affordable prices to first time home buyers. They're currently shooting season number three, which airs this summer. Keith Bynum and Evan Thomas join me. Gentlemen, nice to see you. So season three is upon us. What would you say is the main difference between when you started till now? For season three, you'll get to see we're doing, a, well, if the historic board approves it, but we're doing a rather large addition to the house and um, replacing the garage and just kind of taking it back to the original beautiful historic house it was, so, and expanding it a little bit. Detroit is changing very rapidly. One of the major changes that we've seen is that there's definitely a lot less abandoned homes, which is making our job a little bit harder. So if we were to look at our budgets for season three versus season one, there's houses that are twice as much, and we're definitely not selling them for twice as much. So it is kind of a little bit of a margin crunch. Is your strategy ultimately to help build wealth because at the end of the day we know that home ownership is highly connected to correlated to uh, to to wealth one of the major issues that that we see in all of these neighborhoods is that for a long time a lot of these houses were really sort of like ridiculously under undervalued and so even if someone owned a home it had no value a lot of the first time home buyers that buy these houses are also the first generationally to own a home. So it's kind of crazy to see what that does in their pride and really for the next generation too to see that come up is exciting. It's been really effective beyond the financial side on the community. It's people investing beyond money. It's investing in the actual, the schools and the living and all of the things that come with that. You go into a neighborhood and you make it much better. So I'm curious if you worry about that impact. Let's talk about the houses that you're not renovating. Do you suddenly make that neighborhood really expensive for the people who are, are there but don't own their homes? Detroit has been really smart about addressing this very problem and it's, um, I don't fully understand it so I, wanna, <laughs> I don't wanna over speak, but it's uh, essentially like a slow ad adaptation of the tax value. So over time, it's a kind of gradual increase into the tax level that it should be. And that helps kind of offset some of that potential for displacement, which for a neighborhood like this, um, it's really possible for that to happen. There are other cities too, unfortunately, that have lots of homes that are in distress. Do you guys see yourselves moving into other neighborhoods after Detroit or alongside of Detroit? I'm tied to Detroit, but I would love to mentor others in other cities like we've had people from Baltimore, Pittsburgh, DC reach out and say, you know, I'm on the same path, like tell us how you did this. And so I think there's opportunity for us to mentor at least. And if there's a show out of it, then so be it. <laughs> I love hearing that. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Keith Bynum and Evan Thomas. Thanks for joining me. Thank you very much for having us. Thanks. You bet.